Drama TV with me, Gabrielle Ryan. So, from Brad Pitt to James Bond, from James Bond to Bill Clinton, these guys are all known as alpha males and the leaders of the pack. But then we have the better males. For example, Jason Biggs is a better male in all of his film roles and some girls love it because it makes them laugh. But these are the movie stars, so how about in real life? Do girls like alpha males or better males? Let's go get some answers. Do girls like alpha males or better males? Better males. Alpha males. Better males. Better males. Better males. I think it's better to have a balance of both. But for me personally, a tad of alpha male. That's something quite attractive about something that's super confident and knows exactly what he wants. Alpha males. Alpha males to an extent. So, I like an alpha male, but you don't want someone who is an arsehole, who's going to be rude to you, whatever, but you do want someone to take control, because no one likes wet flannel. I like alpha male, but only to have him in bed as an alpha male. Ah, okay, so have you ever dated an alpha male? I have, and it didn't work out. Okay. So it has to be like a mixture. <laughs> So probably like a better male. I think still alpha males, um, but then again, one that can make you laugh would be ideal. So a bit of both would be perfect. Particularly, I think um, alpha male because when you watch movies like X X X X is it X under Cage, uh, Fast and Furious, you always have someone like Vin Diesel who's always a like, strong man who always comes from anything, you know, always succeeds. So I think mostly alpha. Yeah. With better males, the alpha male is. Yeah, there's more attraction, I guess. <laughs> it's like bad boy, but yeah. Personally, I think better male, because like, it's, it's better to have like a weaker like, boy in it, so then like the girl can like step on his toes and that, and then, I don't know really. Have you ever slept with a guy that would be described as a better male, or quite an extreme better male? No. No, not extreme, <laughs> no. <laughs> Out males. Alpha males, why are you, you thinking alpha male? They're just so sexy. <laughs> alpha male, but not too arrogant. Um, better male, and they need to be funny, kind. So I think a good, healthy balance is always important. Why are you thinking alpha male? Because I'm indecisive. <laughs> <laughs> so have you dated alpha males? Yeah. Yeah, and how, how's that for you? <laughs> okay. <laughs> they, I quite like when they take control, but they also kind of understand where you probably need a bit of time and space, and they kind of get that. So yeah. Why do you think a better male? Alpha males are just a bit too big-headed, and you know, because I think women want a partner. They want someone who will collaborate with them in their lives, will support them, uh, but who will support them emotionally and. Um, uh, not just, you know, I mean, I think that women are happy to support themselves financially, but they want someone who's a real emotional partner for them. Everything. <laughs> <laughs> just everything you like more about a better male. So, have you ever dated an alpha male then? Yeah. Yeah, and how did that go for you? <laughs> <laughs> That's very interesting things. So, I like everything about that. So, have you got experience of dating alpha males? Yeah, by far. But it can be a bit dangerous because there's a definitely a great fine line between confidence and arrogance. So that's why it has to be a balance. For our dating services, go to karmalifestyle.com and for more videos like this, come back here with me at Karma TV and click like, subscribe on the button below and share to all your friends. I've been Gabriella Ryan and I'll see you next time.